All right, so this is Pedro, the quadruped robot. It's got a 3D printed construction with 12 servos total, three in each leg, two in the hip and one in the knee. Let's go ahead and turn them on. Pedro is controlled by this remote, dual analog joysticks that are clickable. And turn that on as well. Uh, you control Pedro much like a drone where the left stick controls forward, backward, and left and right translation. And the right analog stick controls yaw rotation and up and down movement. Now Pedro has got three modes of operation, walking, positioning, and single leg control. To access the different modes, you can at any time click the left stick and hold it for about three quarters of a second. Pedro will do a little bounce to indicate that you've entered the mode select menu, and then you can move the left stick in a direction to access a mode. So up will select walking, down will select positioning, and right will access single leg control. So let's start with walking mode by going up. You see a bounce there to indicate he's accepted the mode. When in walking mode, clicking the left stick will swap the robot between crawling and trotting mode. So crawling mode is what we've been in so far. He moves one leg at a time, clicking the left stick, swap the trotting mode, where he moves two legs at a time. Trotting mode is usually a bit quicker. It's actually a little bit better for going over rough terrain as well. Likewise, clicking the right stick will swap its up and down function between controlling the right height, like so, and controlling the stepping height. And notice that nothing is happening because we've entered stepping height change mode, and stepping height only changes when the robot is walking. So you can see now, step height gets really high, or it gets really low. Lowering the step height can be useful for adding stability, and raising the step height can be useful for uh, mobility around, say, carpet or grass or something. You need to step over, put it back to some good happy medium. That's not a happy medium. All right, let's move on to positioning mode by holding down the left stick and pressing down. In this mode, control layout is almost identical to walking in that the left stick controls forward, back, left and right. The right stick controls yaw and up and down. In this mode, clicking the right stick will swap it between controlling yaw and up and down and controlling roll and pitch instead, like so. The left stick will change between positioning mode that's coarse and a fine positioning mode. So this is coarse positioning where it tracks the position of the stick or attempts to and clicking it will switch to fine positioning where it moves at a rate governed by the stick position and then stays there. And likewise, it does the same thing for the right stick functions as well, such as yaw, up and down, roll, and pitch. It'd be useful if you had a camera mounted to Pedro and toggling back to uh, course positioning so, uh, returns him to this initial position. Now for the final mode, taking control of a single leg, which is accessed by entering the mode select menu and pressing right. As you can see, the robot will gracefully shift its weight over the three remaining legs and lift the leg that's been selected to move. Lift, I say. This mode is rather simple to control. It functions much like positioning, except instead of controlling the robot's body, you have control over the tip of its leg. So I'm moving the left stick up and down and left and right causes the leg to move in those directions and up and down causes it to move up and down. Clicking the right stick swaps which leg that you've taken control of. You can cycle through all four legs. And you can do a little wave. And you can cycle through the legs relatively quickly. Let's quickly go back to the front right. Very fun mode.
Okay, that's pretty much it for the Pedro overview. Thanks for watching and keep in mind, Pedro is now available to order. Pedro is ready to go right out of the box and includes the remote, two rechargeable LiPo batteries, as well as a dedicated LiPo charger. Check out the Pedro promotional video on this channel for more details, and I'd really appreciate it. Take it easy.